Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Dynasty. What I got for y'all today is another Soul Calibur 6 video. Of course, just a few days ago, Talum got revealed to be part of the game. But apart from that, there's not been much news in regards to Soul Calibur 6. However, today, got for you guys a lot of small details and information I think are overlooked completely and still worth noting. So pretty much like a news roundup type of video. So with that said, let's get into it. Now, first things first, Soul Calibur 6 is going to have two different story modes in some capacity. And at this point in time, we've only seen one, and that being the Soul Chronicle mode. And, you know, dating back to the story mode trailer from like two weeks ago, we saw like this humongous timeline of events and these like highlights and of course at the roster on the left hand side he had all like the key moments in the middle of like this you know timeline now what's crazy is just a few days ago a brand new article got published that showcased even more screenshots of this like timeline and inside this picture right here bam you can see ad 1586 sophitia versus a very special someone rothian of course rothian being her husband now, obviously, Rothian is not going to be, like, his own single character, like, on the main roster slot. I'm pretty sure he's going to be either, like, a clone or just an NPC. And that's kind of cool because that confirms that, like I mentioned, you know, clones or NPC characters, non-playable characters, will be all throughout the Soul Calibur 6 game mode, you know, Soul Chronicle at the very least. Which is really, you know, shouldn't come off as a surprise. So maybe the likes of, like, Rock, Lee Long, uh, maybe if, like, Raphael's in the game, we see Amy, stuff like that. So it's really cool to see that NPCs or like clone characters have a place in Soul Calibur 6. Reminds me very much of like what we saw in Mortal Kombat X. You know, we had Rain, we had Baraka, we had Sindel. We fought against them. They weren't playable, but uh, you know, they're still part of the story mode. And I guess for Soul Chronicle and Soul Calibur 6, it's going to be the exact same thing. So that has me pretty stoked. They've done this in the past and it seems like again, it's happening for Soul Calibur 6. And like I mentioned, Nobody's really discussed this. I think it's really cool because I'm not too sure who else we could see like I mentioned like Rothian that, That's pretty neat. You know, it's Sophitia's husband Finally in a Soul Calibur game in some regards of course speaking of Soul Chronicle If you actually go over to like the official Japanese website for Soul Calibur 6 right here BAM you can see it reads Soul Calibur 6 underneath that it says game mode and then from there We see you know Soul Chronicle we just discussed earlier, but right next to it where it gets really interesting is two empty slots that just say coming soon now obviously safe to assume that maybe just maybe one of these is going to be create a soul it's been teased for a couple months now as for that very last game mode i really don't know maybe it's going to be the other story mode maybe it's team battle maybe it's a survival game mode maybe it's just you know something we've never seen before so at this point in time no word on what these two game modes are officially but like i mentioned i think one's probably create a soul unless maybe Creative Soul is like not even like meant to be part of like this section. It's like separated. So might be two completely different game modes. I, I don't know. It's got me pretty excited. But yes, two game modes coming very soon for Soul Calibur 6. Now, random tidbit here is the description for Soul Chronicle reads, A story mode drawing a magnificent story about sword and sword sword. Main story is focused on the main story and the stories of all characters intersect. So there is a really rough translation from Google Translate that was in Japanese, but there you go. So Chronicle in a really rough summary. Finishing things up though, it turns out that Motohiro Okubo has been a little vocal on his Twitter page. Of course, dating back to I want to say like a month ago, he kind of teased Talum and of course Talum got revealed this week. And it seems like he might be doing the exact same thing. You know, this is from a few days ago as well. He said this, bam. Amazing to see many talent players. Thank you all for uh time to sleep. Still tons of work to deliver the best Soul Calibur. And like the way he kind of like formatted this tweet is kind of similar to what we did when he did format the tweet about Talum. So many people think this might be a tease in some regard. I'm trying to break this down. I've been trying for a couple days now. I don't really see what this could be, but apparently it might be. So yes, Akubo possibly teasing the next character for Soul Calibur 6 with this like, you know, the format of this tweet but anyways guys that is all i got for y'all today like i mentioned nothing too groundbreaking but if anything i think it's really cool how rothian and other npcs are probably gonna be inside of soul chronicle also two game modes coming soon so with that said what game modes do you want to see showcase for Soul Calibur 6? What do you want to see, you know, part of the game? What other clone slash NPC characters do you want to see showcase during this Soul Chronicle game mode? And last but not least, was Akubo teasing something there? I mean, I don't know. Just looking at it again, bam. Capital A for amazing, capital T, Astaroth, Tira. 
I don't, I don't know, guys. Do you think this was a tease like how he did for Talib? I'm curious. Of course, if you did enjoy the video, please take one second and drop a like on it. Make sure to subscribe for some more Soul Calibur 6 content. Until next time, I've been your host. I've been Dynasty. Take care. Stay safe. And I'll see you guys later. Peace. Your setups, you one of the greatest. You deserve more exposure, man. You underrated. To all the dynasty haters, promise you'll love them later. Y'all gon' react like he did when he seen the trailer. But hold up, let me hit y'all with a twist. Wait, I'm sub zero. The rap game is the link. Wait, you see, I've been a fan of dynasty for years now. GTA, MK, and justice. I'm still down. Rapper meets gamer. I wonder how y'all.